Hey YouTube, hey, I'm gonna do this review outside because the lighting in my house always seems to be sort of poor the way it works with my iPhone. Anyway, this is the James Farm Sour Cream and n n most no one's ever heard of this product. No one knows anything about it. But they sell it at Restaurant Depot and it's a sour cream that says it's distributed by Restaurant Depot. See down here? Well, my favorite Mexican restaurant in the Atlanta area called El Torero, I know uses the sour cream on their uh, deluxe nachos. I know this because I've seen them with this product on their counter. And I've also seen it outside their store uh, wherever they throw their trash, just outside their door, their side door. This is that one on Satellite Boulevard. They're using this product, James Farm Sour Cream. Now, I don't know if they add anything to it, but I know they use it. Anyway, this sour cream is super rich, super delicious, and the tub that El Torero uses is like a giant, like 40 pound tub or something. But this is a smaller one Restaurant Depot sells, and I managed to get this off Instacart, and it was like seven bucks or something. So what I'm going to do with this is I'm going to pull some of it out and put it in this bowl. And then I'm going to take this bowl through the Taco Bell drive through and get um, a Nachos Bel Grande and use this sour cream and put it on. And I just I'm so excited. I can't wait. Now, I did buy this a couple weeks ago. And while it does say it's good till March 20th, today is March the 8th. So I don't know if there's going to be any standing water in here when I open it up. We're about to find out. Ooh, look at that. No water, but also it hadn't been opened. Look at that. Look how thick that is. That is really thick. <laughs> My gosh, look how thick it is. It's so thick. I can put in like half the spoon and it's still standing up. This is very consistent with the product that they use on those nachos at El Torero. Y'all, I have no idea how excited this is. I will say this though, the last thing I need to be doing is consuming an entire thing of this sour cream by its due date. And my wife doesn't like sour cream, so she won't be eating any of it. But I do, I am definitely gonna try this product as a topping at um, Taco Bell today and also I'm gonna try it by mixing some Lipton um, mix into it to see how it turns into a dip so follow me along on this video and we'll see how it goes I do want to show more of this uh, packaging real quick it says a two tablespoon serving is um, what does that say five grams of fat 50 milligrams sodium two carbs Ingredients are cultured sour cream. I just took a bite of it just by itself and it is off the chain rich. It is just what they have at my favorite Mexican restaurant and it doesn't taste anything like Breakstones or Daisy. I mean, it is like a sour cream in its own world this is what it should say on here where it says satisfaction guaranteed it should say a sour cream in its own world all right i have made a run for the border medium dr pepper nachos bol grande crispy taco bean burrito this is like nine bucks getting kind of pricey at the border these days anyway I thought about having them keep off the sour cream because their sour cream while tasty is wimpy here is the James Farm sour cream look at that yeah so
Let's just put, a, put some of our own on there. Yum. You know, I don't have the recipes for El Torero, but I know where the sour cream is. What if Taco Bell used James Farm sour cream? How cool would that be? Mmm, yum. Oh, yeah. You know what? <laughs> yeah. That's where the action is. The flavor on the James Farm product is so concentrated and so rich. On a scale of 1 to 10, the richness of this being a 10 compared to the Taco Bell richness. I'd give Taco Bell like a three. No, I'm not complaining about Taco Bell. I love Taco Bell, but this James Farm stuff is unbelievable. Now you can get James Farm sour cream on Instacart through Restaurant Depot. That's the way to do it. Mmm. You know, I like Daisy and I like Brickstone. But it just doesn't have the same richness as this product. I realize this is a little excessive, but I'm going to do it. Yeah. Mmm. 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 -mm -mm. All right, so I'm still working through this. I still have some sour cream left, but I need to save the sour cream for my taco. Should have brought more with me. Look at that. It's epic. Okay, so here is a regular crunchy beef taco from Taco Bell. I love them. I love the uh, Supremes. Of course, there's a convenience factor when you buy a Supreme taco because, well, you're there and they have the sour cream, but this sour cream is the best. So, we're going to put it in our taco. What's left of James Farm sour cream? And spread it out. Ooh, look at that. With our fork. There it is, spread out with a fork. Mmm. Mmm. Well. Yeah. You know what? Taco Bell should switch. And if they don't, not a big deal. Just go buy your own James Farm sour cream and do it yourself. Thanks for watching, and make it a great day. Just look how that sour cream responds. I think it is. It's like standing up. It squeezes out. It's not running. Beautiful.